Welcome back to my channel. I'm doing a vlog today, so if you guys are interested, stay tuned. Disclaimer, this may be a little inappropriate for younger audiences. Um, I will try to keep it PG. Many of you guys may know that I was in the adult industry this past year, um, and I kind of want to go more into depth about that and let you guys in on it. All right, so when I was 18 years old, um, just graduated high school, and my goal was to get into mainstream modeling. Well, that kind of took a turn. Um, also, I'm going to be referring the adult industry as the industry. So I know that the adult industry gets a pretty bad rap, um, which just the mainstream media. And, you know, being in it, I've kind of seen the truth behind it. Um, I know a lot of people think that drugs and alcohol and just a lot of abuse is in the industry. That might be true for some people, but I know in my experience, um, I dealt with none of that. And actually, I had a pretty good experience being in it. Um, I worked with a very, very well-known professional company. Um, it's more like I would describe it as an art form. For those of you who may think that I'm a monster for what I've done, um, I just kind of like want you to know that I'm not like what you think I am. I know that I am a good person and I try to be the best that I can be. Um, and I've just learned a lot with being in the industry and I've learned how to have a healthy sexual relationship. Um, and you know that involves not having multiple partners because it just makes it tricky um but for any of those out there who are going to be giving me hate for this you know i'm not going to be easily affected by this so that's okay <laughs> fast forward a couple months since graduating high school um it was time for me to fly out for my first shoot and the feelings that I had were nervousness, um, I was scared, I didn't know what to expect, um, just kind of conflicted emotions, I didn't really know if I wanted to do this, um, and just kind of like set myself into autopilot. But um, yeah, the first scene happened and then I was out again for a second one and by that time but I have a philosophy in life that you never do something half-assed. And, you know, I'm proud of myself for reaching the top the way I did and giving it, giving it my all. Guys, if you're going to do something, you might as well be the best at it. Fast forward four shoots. Um, I was finally crowned Vixen Angel. And basically, the company I was working for, Vixen, um, it's like the playboy of the adult industry. Um, so very like top tier. Um, that's kind of like where you want to be when you're in that industry. So Vixen Angel is a pretty like prestigious uh, title and a lot of the models who get chosen for this have a very high following on Instagram and they're very well known in what they do. Um, and I had the opportunity to be a part of that. So. A huge success in my career and you know I'm pretty like brand new to this so um, yeah I was very honored to have that title um, so after that um, you know a couple more shoots later I've been flown out to you know kind of around the country I've been flown out of the country to France and whatnot and you know, just having amazing experiences that I wouldn't have had any other way, I feel like. Um, and just, you know, learning a lot about myself and building my career and building my name. And I kind of felt like that was, I've hit like the top, I've hit my peak in this industry and I want to move on to other things. And so now, um, I'm moving on to the mainstream modeling, at least I'm trying to, and I'm trying to build a name outside of the adult 
industry. Um, so that's kind of where I am at right now. Um, I'm also, you know, a part-time student. Um, so it's, you know, balancing both is a little difficult, but I'm managing and, you know, my goal for this next year is to gain a presence in that mainstream. So that's also what I'm doing here on YouTube. Um, just so you guys can kind of see me in a different light and like, you know, it's not all about sex and whatnot that I know a lot of girls in that industry are known for. So, you know, I have a little bit of a personality behind it, but yeah. On that note, um, for any of you girls out there who want to get into the modeling industry, um, I strongly advise you not to go into the adult industry um, just on my own experience. It's not going to make getting into modeling any easier. It's actually going to prevent you from getting a lot of work with companies just because they don't want to be associated with that title. Um, and also, if you're not comfortable with having sex on camera, don't do it. Don't do it for the following. Don't do it for any reason other than you want, you know what you're getting into and you know that you want this. All right, so thank you guys for watching. Um, if you guys have any more questions for me, don't be afraid to drop it down in the comment and let me know if you want to see any more of these vlogs. All right.